Well, Sarah, out here along the Weathersfield Rocky Hill Town line, the roads are clear, but they're still wet from our winter weather. And as uh, the night continues, the concern now turns to those potential icy conditions across the state. As the snow began to let up Tuesday, people all across the state began clearing the snow once again. And shoveling it, shoveling has been mostly just pushing everything to the side very little. The ice has been a little hard to work with. As you could see, there's patches of ice that you have to work on. But the work wasn't done as homeowners prepared for the potential icy conditions. That's a special rally we put in for, for my wife. The guy who put it in said, can't use salt. So I used cat litter. He told me to use cat litter on this one and it works effectively. The timing of this winter storm posed a challenge for road crews. It was falling during that morning commute, continued through the evening commute. Uh, so just a lot of extra volume on the roadway, which means that our crews to do their routes takes them a little bit longer. Drivers out and about Tuesday evening said for the most part, road conditions were good. Slippery. Uh, it's been cool for the most part, though. The roads out here, a lot better than other areas in the, you know, in the towns in the city. But as the night goes on, black ice is a concern for cities and towns and for the State Department of Transportation. Remember, with these temperatures dropping, you know, that wet spot on the road, it may look like it's just damp. Just go ahead and, you know, consider that, that it's ice. You know, just think that it's going to be ice, you know, slow down, make sure that they're giving themselves lots of time, uh, some extra time to get to their destination. Officials are urging people to stay home, but if you do have to travel overnight, be extra cautious. Well, officials also want to remind people to uh, take that extra time on the roads for tomorrow morning's commute. And of course, our Weather Watch team will be keeping you informed and alert all morning long to get you where you need to be safely. Live in Rocky Hill, Jay Garcia, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.